Hello everyone, so absolutely cracked at the moment. Um, a big thank you really to the Night Vision Builders team again. Um, I was having a bit of a hash with this bloody Vision 750. Uh, top tip, um, as one great guy said, have you done a continuity test? Gavin's response is kind of cut the cable to a degree. So, um, so I've, got, I've got told off. But anyway, so let's go with, through what we've got. Uh, because I think this is useful for those who, I mean, if you want to use the Vision 750 in the way it's built, you can do. There's no problem with that. Uh, I, for my needs, has wanted to play around with it and obviously build some form of funky near eye unit. But again, I need to play around with it all. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to draw out what we've got, how it's put together, and then we'll work from there. Uh, this is very much, there's going to be no kind of, uh, I'm going to follow probably up with a kind of this destruction video, that's all I can call it for now, of what I did to get it all wired up, but for now I think this will actually yeah, serve a good purpose. So, so what we'll do is we'll just go through what we've got. So, so we've got the screen itself, and excuse the blue, I seem to have lost uh, my uh, black pen, but there we go. So that's, that's kind of where your I would come in, so let's draw a pretty eyelids and eyelashes, and there we go. And generally what you would do is you're kind of going to be looking through there, and you've got a little lens that comes in, you've got a, a, a screen in there. Now at the back end of this, there's a circuit board here, and also a circuit board there. Now they're connected by a ribbon cable, like so to a degree. Now, if you, you can pull this off, now if you pull that off in any given force, and this is where you've got to be a bit careful, is if you pull that off, that ribbon cable is going to take beating. Uh, they're notoriously flimsy and they can break dead easy. And so just go careful if you are taking that off to just be aware of that. Now, what comes off here is, well, this, that's a really bad example, but we'll go for it. So. What you've got there is you've got four four connectors, well, four wires or terminals, whichever way you want to call them, and it's soldered in. And generally what you've got is you've got one which is a uh, red, so that's our positive. You've got one that comes off which is black. That's our negative. You've got a white cable which is our um, video feed. And then you've got an unshrouded uh, cable, so uh, just, uh, uh, we'll call it naked. Oh, we'll have a bit of a laugh. Naked cable. And that is a second negative. Okay. Now, when you're wiring this up, uh, this is a five volt camera. Now, I've got, uh, and I need to test it again, is I generally run a, a camera board that is supposedly to run at 12 volts, and I've run it at 7.4 volts, and it works quite well, and it has done for many a time uh, without any issues. So I'm comfortable with that. So. I've, I had a problem with one of the camera boards initially. It was a bit, I forgot that it was a broken one and I had my own little Christmas present. I found a box that I've got some other cameras in, which was great because I've been putting people off from buying some <laughs> kits. So, but anyway, that's that's bye bye. So what we've done here, because we know what we want to connect to, we then want to go for connecting them to the camera board. So if we say that we've got the camera board and this can be for any other camera as uh, so this is with the lens on. So what you'll generally have off here is a connector, let's do it like that, with three cables. I'm doing this really badly. Um, one's red. Uh, middle one is generally black, and this one will be potentially yellow. 
Now, just as a quick hint, and I've, I've, I've done this before, and I've, I've actually done a video about where I did a bit of a cock up. The, these cables, you can buy these cables from eBay, and what tends to happen, you've got a camera board, and the yellow and the red is flipped the other way around. So you plug the, your cable in, as if you go for the colour connecting red to red, black to black, yellow to your white, what you could run into is a problem because you're actually feeding a positive, or well, trying to get positive into your video feed and vice versa, and you'll, you'll screw it up. So just be mindful, all it is, you can actually check on the camera board or with the likes of the, the run cam and other kind of uh, ones out there like the E700, uh, they should have either documentation with it or there'll be a little kind of wiring diagram on the back. So that'll give you the basis. So, so how I've connected this up, because my uh, cameras run on 12 volts, I've taken it this way. So I've got a voltage dropper. So that goes 12 volts in and five volts out. So you've got plus, negative, out, plus, negative, in. So with my power supply, which is essentially two 1865 batteries, Poor diagram I know. What I've done is I've taken, so this will be my plus, that'll be my negative. I've taken my plus to go in there, negative to go in there. So that's fine. But also what I've done is for my camera, I've actually connected it here. I've kind of spliced that cable there. And then with the black, all I've done is I've connected that one there. The yellow goes up to my white cable, my black negative from the screen comes down here and also the second negative comes down there. So I've got three connections to my 5 volt input or out, sorry output as you would say, sorry it's the into the 5 volt input. I then have my red wire coming through, snaking through from there. So that gives me my five volts into my um, near eye, the Vision 750. And I've also got my, uh, essentially the 7.4 volts, which will power this camera no problem, even though it's 12, it, it, it works. So that's how to do the wiring. And now I know that that's messy uh, and I'm really sorry for it, but. It is what it is. Now, I'm going to do a link to a web page in the description. You're going to have to leave it with me for a while to my website, uh, doi-nightvision.com. Bit of self-promotion there. And what that will do is I'm going to, uh, I've got a, a list on there about wiring diagrams and setting things up. Now, I think that will help a lot of people out. Uh, the, same, the principles are all the same, actually, in terms of connecting all these wires, but this is, an, an, I'm saying newish, I mean, I think this uh, Vision 750 has been out on the market for a while now, uh, but it's only kind of come to my attention, just recently, to kind of play around with, and unfortunately, again, I've been all over Christmas, I got it around uh, just before Christmas, and I've meaning to be playing around with this uh, way before now. It's a nice little unit. Uh, I've got some reservations initially on how the the image looks at the moment. I think we might struggle uh, with some people, but in other people's preference, it actually might suit quite well. It seems that the whilst the image is there, it seems far away. But I'm going to play around with the focus and let you know my thoughts. So that's it for now. Uh, hopefully, the rambling has not been too bad, and you can follow that. If there's any questions or queries in the then the video itself, or from the video itself, just let me know, put it in the comments, and then I'll respond back and just let you know uh, what's what. Obviously, if I come across any other problems, you know, just follow the, the video itself and then we'll, we'll sort it out. Okay, many thanks. Speak to you later. Bye.